Top tier, no carrier. Wow. <clears throat> I guess you can't bring a Death AA ship and have a carrier in the enemy team. It's just not going to happen. I think Cleveland was the only one I had in the entire day that had a Death AA and a carrier. Uh, but I still think uh, Z46 against Nostrashimi, Z should be the one in control of the cap. You can't exactly just take Nostrashim in an open gunfight unless you're a really, really badass gunboat DD. Because you will hurt him, but he will hurt you back. But he has a monster heal. Well, it's not as strong as it used to be, but I'm sure you can calculate. 425 times 20 times 3. Um, it's going to bring back HP and you're not. And eventually he's gonna kill you, even though you're the gunboat. How the game's going today? Special as always. What do they have? Seattle. That's it. That's all we have to be worried about. <clears throat> all right. Well, and torpedoes, I guess. Eight thousand four hundred and fifty HP per heal. That's two to three times more than a regular destroyer. Regular DDs get back what? Two, three thousand HP per heal. If I'm not mistaken. So this thing will get this thing will eventually get you killed. That's why you have to be careful. Gunning it down, you have to gun it down really fast. Or it will heal most of it up and come back. And if you don't have a heal and you got hurt, you're in trouble. In the long run, it just Yeah. Out heals you pretty much. Oh wow, insta radar. Didn't expect that. Now hold on, gents. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me take the cap first, yeah? There you go. Now, now you can shoot. See, that wasn't so hard. Slam on the brakes a little bit. Juke all the shells. Call a GG. And get the fuck out. Not a scratch. Not a scratch. No, it's not that they can't shoot for shit, it's just that nobody expects the DD that's in the middle of the map and radared in front of the entire enemy team to just stop. Like, 99% of people don't do that. At least 99% of people don't do that. No, and, and, and nobody used to do that. I started doing that in competitive. I'm like, <laughs> you gotta predict what your enemy thinks they you will do. So, alright. I predict... They predict me going in the cap. I predict them radaring me. They predict me running away. Is there anything I can alter here? I have to go to the cap. They will have the radar. They will radar me. They will shoot me. What can I do? I can decide to not run away. But that's crazy. Yes, it is. And it will work. And it does. Very often. From now on, 99% of people will do that. Nah, people don't have the balls to do that. That's the thing. And you kind of need to know how and when to do that. You can't just stop. Most people don't know. What did I lose? I lost Algeria in the middle of the day. Good shit. Uh, fuck. Drake, what are you doing? You just fucked up my entire play. This goddamn guy just fucked up my entire plan. Oh, man. 
Dude all of a sudden just decided to pull a crazy Ivan on me. God damn it, bro. No! Ah, fuck, I didn't want to touch. I didn't want to slam T. Uh, well, he can't see us anymore at least. And no torpedo hits. Nice. I mean, it's okay, we can heal most of this back. But let's not comment on the fact that there's a Seattle six kilometers next to us. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no good, no good. Yeah, everybody in the enemy team was going that way, and then all of a sudden, that Drake pulls a, like a, I don't know, 180 turn. And I'm like, it, and just as I decided to turn in to get the best possible angle, he completely fucked me over with that maneuver. And that, of course, made the, the rest of the team turn as well, so... Forget about scoring any torps. And now I don't have a smoke. Is that a steel camo? How do you get a steel camo with Venom? Oh, they changed something, I forgot. Yikes. Print, 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 less print. Well, at least we're getting the full, uh, full heal out of our heal this time. Max HP, I mean. We got our asses handed to us twice, and we still have half HP and a heal. That's no strashimi for you. But if it wasn't for that Drake, this game would have went a lot different. And then I would be able to show you the actual proper strength of this ship. Unfortunately. Because you gotta make both guns and torpedoes work with this ship. To make it... Uh to make it work. If it's just guns or just torps, you're kind of missing out. And as you can see, I'm definitely not making my torps work so far. I wish I had a uh, speed boost now. <sighs> Can I actually outrun this guy? 5.6 detection, should be able to. Protection by air, 2.4. There's no fucking way you know. Does Lazo get a hydro? I don't think Lazo gets a hydro, does it? God damn it, dude. There's no way. There's no way he just pulled that turn without knowing these torpedoes are coming. He does? Oh, okay. Yeah, that, that settles that then. 
That's the second time this Musashi dodges a bullet because not because of his skill, but because his allies. Drake saved his ass first time, and now Lazo second time. Yeah, what can you do? What's in B? Venom, probably. What's fascinating about this Musashi, he's always sailing in a straight line. Right until the point there's torpedoes. So he's really lucky that to have teammates that uh, catch a glimpse of these torps every time for him. Oh, Benamol has 2000 HP. And he probably detected the torpedoes now from Musashi again. Although I don't see him dodging this time. Your luck ran out, buddy. One from afar. I did not expect uh, a citadel, but I'll take it. Is that guy actually gonna die just before we get this fire? Eh? 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 Got him! And you know what, Judd? This match was actually pretty meh. Because it took us way too fucking long to finally sink the, the Musashi. And we kind of got caught a couple of times. A couple of times. So, if it wasn't for that crazy Ivan move from Drake, we would have gotten like 50-60k at least immediately off of Musashi. And that entire group would have probably turned around and started running instead of pushing. And then, you know, we would just work towards our damage towards the end. But we were pretty much being hunted this entire game, and we still got away with this result. But the only way you're going to accomplish this is if you combine your guns with torps, with good scouting, because you have 5.6 concealment, um, and you have insanely strong heal for a DD. If you got stressed by this game, just use Rockia. Rockia. It helps against everything. Essentially, if it is self-made. Mm -hmm. Thank you for 16 months, Kanjin. Appreciate it. So, yeah, like, the way to make Nostrashimi work is you have to combine everything. That's why you don't see a lot of these ships, because they're not straight up OP. Because they, they're not the best gun boats. They're not the best torp boats. They don't have the most amount of HP. They don't have... Um, the best concealment, they don't have the best AA, they don't have hydro, radar, really good smokes, but they have a pretty decent 
everything. Four guns with fast uh, shells and decent damage. Ten torps that are decent. Pretty good concealment. Okay smoke. Decent AA. And you need to combine all of those. It's like a jack of all trades. You need to combine everything. And boom. You got yourself a good game. It's a decent ship when played properly. But a lot of people will not know how to play this ship and get the best get the best out of it because you just need to be pretty good at everything amazing heals yes yes gg though